I'm going to talk indeed about the Zycon solutions. And what we are presenting here is a Zycon 3300, which is standing behind me, with an inline decode configuration. And the reason why we're illustrating this is because we really want to trigger your fantasy so you can see what the capabilities are of a digital print solution. With this solution, we can demonstrate you a change over time of zero minutes, zero seconds, with only two or one repeat from one going from one job to the other job. So that is really eliminating the majority of the waste that you find in a, in a production environment um, and is then for sure contributing to your profitability and productivity. But uh, before I talk more about that aspect, I'm going to explain a bit more about the, uh, the Zycon technology. Zycon technology has been on the market for more than 18 years, so really one of the pioneers, one of the innovators of full color digital printing. Um, we have always worked with dry toner and we have actually specifically chosen to work with dry toner because there are some clear benefits from dry toner. One thing, um, and on top of that, we've even, to serve the market to its full extent, we've even made a unique toner for the label market, trying to comply to all the standards, all the requirements that the market has. And that's the toner that we're using here at this point. Now, what, is the, what are the reasons why Zycon has chosen to work with dry toner? There's, there's a, a lot of them, but I, I'll name you five. One is, for example, it's a very reliable process. Uh, the inks are very stable. They are, do not, their characteristics do not change over time, which are contributing to stability in the printing process. The second thing is that dry toner allows you to print on conventional materials. So the materials that you're using in your flexo environment, in your narrow web offset environment, those will be the materials that you use on this machine. So you don't have to double your warehousing cost or make your warehousing more complicated or pay extra for pre-coating or pre-treatment. A third thing is that this, this uh, dry toner allows you also to achieve a one pass, op one pass opaque uh, white, which we're also illustrating on this metallized material that we're printing now. A one pass opaque white, then we're talking about achieving an opacity of 0.15, which is really unique in the market. Another aspect is the, the light fastness. So we have chosen to work with quality inks, with quality pigments to achieve a very high light fastness, fastness, ensuring that your product looks nice today, but also in two, three or six months down the road, that the colors do not fade based upon the UV light it's exposed to. And the last thing, and I'm happy that I have to do this the last time now. If there's any volunteers, please stand up, but I'm going to taste the toner. So the dry toner itself, I got my finger in the magenta here, the dry toner itself is also FDA approved for indirect and direct food contact. So you can actually eat the toner without doing any harm to yourself. If there's any volunteers, be my guest. That's the only free toner we ever give. <laughs> um, so I've talked about the dry toner. We have also five printing stations and each printing station has a printing head that can write that writes at 1200 dpi print resolution. That 1200 dpi allows you to do a, a very fine details, offset look alike, very smooth vignettes, and it really enhances the, the the image quality of the printing process. Besides that, we have also an inline densitometer here, and the inline densitometer takes care of calibrating your machine from day to day but also calibrating your machine from one to the other. So if you have three digital presses sitting next to each other, they can calibrate from one to the other without having any uh, defects. And on top of that, it also allows you to measure density. So the high density, the 70% points, the 50% points, the 20% points. And um, those, those, um, <coughs> in doing so, you, you do not only maintain your, your color, but you actually control your complete tone curve, which is really unique in the industry. A third thing what the inline densitometer does is inline registration measurement and also correction. So it takes care actually of monitoring all your image quality. So I've talked about the machine. Now uh, you see that the, the labels are going inside the, the decode system. The decode is the inline configuration that we, uh, the inline solution, inline converting unit that we're offering to the market. It's also sold and serviced by ourselves. You have a UV varnish system on that, a laminating system, a UV curing, semi-rotary, full rotary die cutting, slitting and rewinding at the end. And we have that 
uh, we have such a unit for each, each machine in our portfolio. Why do I mention that? Well, our portfolio exists out of four digital presses. We have, and, those, and the presses differ in terms of printing width or in printing speed. So we have presses that go from 200 millimeter wide or 7.9 inch up to 13 inch or 330 millimeter. Actually, the, three, the 3300 is one of them. But on top of that, we also have machines that can go from 250 millimeter wide up to 516 millimeter. So that, that we have that parameter as a variation, the printing width. And on top of that, we also have machines with different printing speeds. For example, 3300 prints almost 20 meters per minute in five color mode. Besides the 3300, we also have the 3500, a machine that also prints 20 meter, almost 20 meters per minute at 500 millimeter wide. In doing so, that machine is the most productive digital label press that you can find today on the market. So I've talked about our portfolio, I've talked about the finishing units. I think I forgot to speak about the full rotary aspect. So one thing that I forgot to mention is that you've got five printing stations in here and that, that, that allows you to really have a full rotary architecture. So what it does is it allows you to print labels very small, very long, without compromising on your printing speed. You keep a constant speed there. And um, on top of that, the, it doesn't, it doesn't matter how many colors you will be using. If you're using three colors, four colors, five colors, again, your printing speed is kept, is kept constant. Just to illustrate, and we've, we weren't able to die cut the label that big, we've actually and I'm going to ask Kuhn. Kuhn is my lovely assistant. He was the guy that took uh, care of the machine for four days, making sure that she was fit to run. But just to illustrate you, this is, for example, a label that you can easily print on the system here and uh, shows you what the capabilities of full rotary is. With this banner, we also, from our side, we want to express our thanks to the uh, Label Expo organization and to all the people that have been here for the past, uh, for the past four days. I mean, it was a real joy to be here in Brussels and uh, we all hope to see you again in two years' time.